I don't think I actually ever died completely on that game, so I'm going to stop playing that because I've been doing it for about 20 minutes. That was a little too long because I've got a lot of games to go through. I will next be doing, as my friends over at uh, GameSack would say, it makes of power. Warriors of Rome. I don't even think it's on the Twitch choices. Imagine that. It's not. Alright, so I apologize if you come in to watch Todd's Adventures in Slime World and see Warriors of Rome.
That's about 10 minutes of that. Um, fun strategy, but probably not so fun to watch. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and get to the next game. Crackdown. It's a nifty little game, if I remember correctly. If not, then I just lied to you, and it's crap.
dead again. So we'll go ahead and see if we can steal stuff with some Bonanza Brothers. Probably pronounced it wrong. I need to print out the new cover art. This one looks like crap. Anywho, what I got. Let's do this. <laughs> So this time we're going to do some Game Gear games. Um, like before. I don't know who this is. Hold on.
games than that but apparently only just one so now we're going to go to oh what is it Arcus Odyssey let's go ahead and update this twitch <laughs> here we go back to the Genesis for our next one and then back to the game gear you know what? Let's just get the Game Gear out of the way. Our next Game Gear game then. Haley's War! And then I'll just put the Genesis back up. That way I don't have to switch the system back again. I think they came out at the same time, it's just alphabetically how it chose those games. Here we go.
it's at least one. Now we'll go ahead and do our against game. Also, here's that solitaire poker box if anyone wanted to see what that game was. It looks like normal solitaire. And I was kind of almost disappointed that it wasn't. That's okay. Let me go ahead and get this guy started up. I need to get me a SCART switch. It's ridiculous. So I gotta first upgrade the computer so that way it can be better resolution to get the watching. You know, all the fun stuff. I don't know. I'll eventually get around. With a better computer, I can edit it so on YouTube you guys can just not hear me talk about nothing and just see the individual games. That way I just have every game that I own, small clips for each one of them. All right, here we go. There I am. All right, we're gonna do some Speedball Deluxe. Uh, I've played this before. Not not the biggest fan, but 
Gotta try it again. That's all right. Next is Sonic the Hedgehog. Maybe you've heard of that. Uh, most of these are crap games, but this one's actually really good. But not this one. The one after. Get ready! Get ready! Okay, that's about all I can handle that. And I can see no one's really watching anyway, so it doesn't matter. Maybe we'll get some more with Sonic the Hedgehog. Alright, put that in first. Sonic the Hedgehog. So, funny story about Sonic. I've been on a quest to find the version 1 with the Genesis uh, release. So I don't want to buy a Mega Drive or a, um, I think some European copies also have it. So, we've got the Canadian release, normal Sonic ROM, obviously the regular Sonic release, and yes, it, it's not a... A retail version at all. Uh oh, it is the retail. It's not the not for sale. I do have the not for sale one too because I'm a nerd. But that is inside my box. Uh, Genesis with the Sonic the Hedgehog, and then I also picked up the uh, Sega Classic one. The only noticeable difference is how they printed it. They actually like made some color to the Genesis, uh, the Sega logo, but. All three games have the same exact ROM. It's a version zero ROM. So, it's got the glitch and the labyrinth zone and uh, clouds are all stationary and such. But we'll go ahead and play this one, which is the greatest hits version, which was also actually assembled in America, not Mexico, or Japan. So, let's go ahead and start this guy up.
right. I think that's enough Sonic for one day. Ah, Paper Boy! I've already done it once on the Master System. I'll do it again on the Genesis. I think I get a Game Gear version. And I got the sequels. Yay. Now, maybe by the time I get to the last one, I'll be okay at this stupid game. But I die a lot on it. <laughs> I usually can get to like maybe one round of houses. Sorry, making you guys stare into the side of my head. I'll go ahead and delete all that crap. I think it's on YouTube. Maybe. I don't know. It takes a lot of time. Once I get a good computer, I might be able to do all that crap. <sighs> well, that was um, fun. Thunder Fox. Yay. This is another arcade ported game for the Genesis because that's pretty much most of the game that it came from. Uh, or that it got. Let's go ahead and play some.
we go, another one down. All right, there we go. Saint Sword will be our next game. <coughs> another arcade port. Yay! <laughs> oh, ninety-one. What did you do to us? Fuck! Huh. Oh my gosh, my stupid...
This time I'll remember to, uh, I don't know, switch the game back. Um, now we'll be doing another Sega made arcade game called Alien Storm, which uh, it's another one that I've done before with the Master System, but now we'll do it with the Genesis. They do that a lot. Uh, soon I'll be on Streets of Rage, which had a Master System release, but I do not own that, so I will not be playing that one. But I will be playing the uh, Game Gear version, which is pretty much the same game. Alien Storm is next. Thank <laughs> you. 
dead. I'm gonna do Marvel Land next. And die in that too, because that seems to be what I do best. Is diet games. Good thing I'm not trying to play these until I beat them. Because I would never I would never get a finish. But let me go ahead and play this one now. Hey Adam. Ha. Ah, haven't talked to you in like years. Thanks for coming and watching me nerd out. So let me get some Marvel Land and then after that we got Raiden Trident. Yeah, I don't like to talk during my game, so um, you'll just hear game stuff.
boom goes to dynamite. Yep, I died a lot. That's what I thought. We're gonna trade a shooter. Tried. I don't know how to pronounce it. I like this shooter. I like shooters, but I'm just not that good at them. So take that as you may. I've been trying to get um or find a decent cheap copy of uh Salamander collection on um the Sega uh Saturn. But it's only in Japan and it's going to be quite um, costly. And here's the lovely little cartridge. Yeah, the the artwork's fake. I, I pointed that because, you know, I, I just bought a bunch of sports games and decided, you know what? I'm not going to buy rebuy a game just for a box. So there it is. Okay. Let's go ahead and try this one now.
Of course I get to the last guy and then instantly die. <sighs> oh well. What can you do? I know what we can do. Put up my games because, you know, I'm making a mess over here. Hold on. Do, 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 do. I don't know. Turn the door. There it is. Okay. Yeah. I bet that's so much fun to watch me put up stuff. <laughs> All right. We have Batman. This is pretty much the uh, Genesis Batman. I mean, of course it's the Genesis. I'm sorry. The Nintendo Batman. Just slightly upgraded for Genesis. At least that's how I look at it. But small characters, you know. Okay, I need to look on interwebs to see how to jump over some blocks. I think what happened was that I let the pipes blow up and I needed to jump off the pipes over the blocks. 
Anywho, I'm dead. Which means watch out because Street Fighter's got nothing on. Street Smarts. Just just the worst. Oh well. I own it. I said I'm gonna play everything I own. So therefore here comes Street Smarts. I guess it could be worse. It could be sports games. Ah, and this week I have no sports games. So I like that. Madden almost killed me. Because I've got so many more Maddens to play. 93, 93 championship, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98. Plus, I think, 99, 2000 on Saturn. Glad I saved money on the opponent, not myself. I would have lost money. All right. I apologize, Adam, if you haven't got bored yet. You will be soon because it's a tactical game. It's a good game, but not that exciting to watch. So I'll do it slow. It's Masters of Monsters. Um, so. Alrighty then. Change it up. <laughs> Alright, let's play some Masters of Monsters.
think you get the point. I just seen what was next, and I'd rather play that. Ha! Huh. We're gonna play some Streets of Rage. Uh, of Rage. What? Maybe I can type all the way. Streets of Rage. There we go. Update. Okay, here's a pretty box. Yay! It's so pretty. Okay. That one I actually have the book for too. Woohoo! Shiny. Let's see how quickly I die with this one. No, I'm. Uh, I can usually get pretty far, but I try to get done with my gaming by two o'clock. Last week I did it till three. It might be the same thing this week too. I need to probably readjust my timing. <laughs> Because the games, I'm, I'm lasting longer on them than I did with the Master System. Alright, anyway, here is...
had to talk. I had to say I was doing good. That's when you die. Oh, well. I've got a few more games to do here. Um, so next one is Vapor Trail. Another arcade port. Another shooter. Another one I like. Another one I die at really quick. I think I'm better at the beat em ups. I should stick to those. Um, our games coming up is Quad Challenge and Populous, which I'm probably going to put Populous in, show you, and turn it off because that's all it's worth. And then Outrun will be our last game. All right, let me go ahead and throw in Vapor Trail. Thank <laughs> you. 
watching because the game sucked. Anyway. Wad challenge. I understand why people would not watch silly things like this. Okay, I can't choose quad challenge, so whatever. Quad challenge. <laughs> this is one of those split screen all the time games, so even when you're not playing two player, it thinks you should be. <laughs> That's like I have a friend. I can't do that anymore. It's like I'm driving a real ATV and I just can't control it. It's just crazy. <sighs> I'm sorry. This was a computer game and it would be so much easier if it was the computer game instead of the Genesis version because you really need a uh, keyboard and mouse to play this or at least a keyboard. Yeah, I could do it with the Genesis controller. Oh no. I might have to switch up. You know what? I'm not going to use the actual cartridge because this one was one of the early uh, electronic art games. So it actually does not play on newer Genesis. And I have a Model 2 Genesis hooked up right now. And I don't feel like hooking up another one. So... I'm going to kind of cheat. <clears throat> I'm going to use my uh, EverDrive. I've already got it set up with this game because I was messing with it earlier. So, I just forgot about it until I got up to the game. So, you're going to see some uh, <clears throat> different menus. Actually, I'll just pick it first. That way you don't have to see it.
my, there's five of us. Ah, okay. It really is just very tedious building up the land, um, helping the little people um, create more and more of a civilization, and then eventually you'll get to the other civilization and you can fight them if you so desire, or you can ally them. But I am not going to do all of that crazy stuff because it's tedious to play and probably even more tedious to watch as I even lost someone else by just turning it on. That's okay. <laughs> That's okay. And uh, the other... Is it Forest or... Uh, we still have... Anyone else here? I don't know who's still left. Somebody that left their keyboard open and just walked away. <laughs> That's okay. Outrun! I like me some Outrun. Really fun. Again, one that I like. It keeps changing scenes and making it more interesting, but it's uh, I, I don't get very. Get ready. <laughs> Checkpoint. and then we get through two stages. Oh well. Thanks for watching. I'm going to do it again next week. Uh, I haven't actually looked to see what's on my next week's... Uh, some more games, more likely. I think it's a lot of Game Gear games next week. So, I uh, will talk to you guys later. Bye.